In this tutorial, we're going to find the characteristic polynomial of the matrix A, which is equal to 1, 2, minus 1, 1, 0, 1, 4, minus 4, 5. The characteristic polynomial which we denote by Pn of lambda is uh, the determinant of A minus lambda I n. So I will write that the characteristic polynomial is the determinant of A minus lambda I n. In this case, we are given a 3 by 3 matrix. Therefore, our identity matrix I n there will also be a 3 by 3 matrix, which is ones on the diagonal. And if we substitute this identity matrix into the formula, which is on the left there, it will result in subtracting lambda from the elements on the diagonal of the matrix A. And uh, the result will be the determinant of 1 minus lambda 2 minus 1, 1 minus lambda 1, 4 minus 4, 5 minus uh, lambda. What we now have to do is uh, to find the determinant of uh, that uh, 3 by 3 matrix. And uh, to find that uh, determinant, we would use uh, the method of a perfect expansion. And when we are using that method, we have uh, the array of positive, negative, positive, negative, and uh, we can expand using any row or column. In this example, I will expand uh, using the first row. So looking at the first element in that row, it's a one minus lambda, and uh, comparing it with the array, we see that it's sitting on a positive. We close uh, the row and the column containing that element. Then what we do is we multiply on that element one minus lambda, multiplied by its sign in the array, which is a positive, then multiply it with uh, the determinant of uh, the uncovered elements. And what we get is one minus lambda, multiplied by the determinant of minus lambda one, four, five minus lambda. We now go on to the next element, which is a 2, and comparing it uh, with uh, the array there, we see that it's sitting on a negative. Then we close the row and column containing the 2. Then now uh, we will multiply the 2 by its sign in the array, then multiplied by the determinant of the uncovered elements. And the result will be minus 2 times the determinant of 1, 1, 4, 5, minus lambda. We now move on to the third element in that row, and it's a minus 1. And uh, we look at its sign in the array, okay? it's a positive. We close at the row in the column containing that element. And then we multiply that element by its sign, so it's minus 1, multiplied by the positive there, then multiply it by the determinant of the uncovered elements. And uh, we'll get uh, minus 1 multiplied by the determinant of 1 minus lambda, 4 minus uh, 4. What we now have to do now is uh, to evaluate uh, the determinants of those two by two matrices that we've just obtained. And uh, to evaluate the determinant of the two by two matrix A, B, C, D, the result is A, D minus B, C. So looking at the first one there, we would have uh, one minus lambda multiplied the determinant of uh, minus lambda one minus four, 5 minus lambda. Using that formula that I've highlighted there, we will therefore this out as 1 minus lambda multiplied by minus 5 lambda plus lambda squared plus 4. Now moving on to the next term, we have minus 2 multiplied by the determinant of 1, 1, 4, 5 minus lambda. And uh, the result will be minus 2 times 5 minus lambda minus 4. And now moving on to the last one, 
we have uh, the determinant of one minus one minus lambda four minus four, and uh, that uh, will give us a minus minus four plus a four lambda. So that is after evaluating those uh, two by two determinants. And uh, what is now left is for us to expand that expression. And when we expand it, we get minus lambda cubed plus six lambda squared minus four lambda plus six. So that is uh, the characteristic polynomial of uh, the given matrix. So we are having the characteristic polynomial of the matrix A is minus lambda cubed plus six lambda squared minus 11 lambda plus six. If you have any questions, you can let me know in the comment section.